assumptions of Coulomb's wedge theory. Following are the nine assumptions of Coulomb's wedge theory or Coulomb's wedge failure theory. One, the backfill is dry and cohesionless. Two, the backfill is also homogeneous and isotropic. Three, the backfill surface is a plane surface and can be inclined. Four, the back of the wall is vertical and can be inclined. Five, the failure surface is a planar surface which passes through the heel of the wall. Six, the backfill is elastically non-deformable but may be breakable. Seven, the sliding wedge is considered to be a rigid body and the earth pressure is obtained by considering the limiting equilibrium of the sliding wedge as a whole. Eight, friction is considered between wall and backfill, therefore, the contact surface is considered rough. Nine, the position and the line of action of the earth pressure are known. To read more, visit civilnotept.com. Thank you.